Hey Stampers! Welcome to another week of Watch It Weekly Wednesday. I'm Aubrey, part of the Stamp and Jill Creative team. And today I'm excited to share with you a new stamp set and dies that are in the mini catalog starting in January. It is the Rainbow of Happiness stamp set along with the Brilliant Rainbow dies. These are so cute. They are so on trend and I'm so excited to show you what I've come up with using this. The best part about this is that in the celebration brochure that is also starting in January, there is paper that is rainbow themed that coordinates with this stamp set and dies. And it's so cute. Let me show you. It's super cute and bright, has all of the colors, and I am a little bit obsessed with it so cute. So it has kind of the more um, imagey si side on this side and then just the more plain colors on the back, which I love. So cute. Okay, so I wanted to show you one idea that I came up with using this product and give you a little tip on how to do it. So I've already cut out this rainbow piece here, you can see it here, and I'm going to use that as a template to stamp this rainbow on my card. So I have a piece of basic white here, and I'm just going to line this up right with the bottom and side of my cardstock, just like that. And I'm just going to hold it in place here. If you need, you can grab some washi tape or a post-it to hold it together, but I don't feel like I need to do that this time. So I'm going to start with Magenta Madness and I'm using this cute little stamp from the stamp set. It's this these three little hearts, so it's little. So I'm going to take that in my Magenta Madness and on my longest rainbow arch here, I'm just going to stamp all of those cute little magenta hearts. Just like that. So you can see I'm going to create that color arch by using the hearts. Just like that. Okay, and I, I'm going to take that all the way down to the bottom. But for time's sake, I'm not going to show you the whole thing. So I'm going to clean off my stamp there. And I'm going to grab my next color, which is Mango Melody. And I'm going to do the same thing on my next arch over here. So Mango Melody, all in that template. Okay. And again, you'll go all the way down to the bottom. So you'll get that entire arch. Next though, the next color I'm going to use is Granny Apple Green. And I'm going to do my third arch. Oh, so cute. And obviously you can do any colors here. They, these are the colors that are in this paper. So it coordinates with that cute paper. Okay. And then the last color I'm going to grab is Pool Party. And I'll do that last arch here, just like that. Super simple, but what a cute way to make our rainbow. Okay, and again, you'll go all the way down to the bottom of that arch. So you can see when I pull that away, We've started making a rainbow, but let me pull in my finished sample and show you what it looks like. So cute. So I have my rainbow of hearts that I've done using this template, just like that. So cute. So let me show you a few other um, cards that I've made using this stamp set and dies and some of them with the cute paper. This one I just used ink and paper 
and made a very simple card, You Make Me Happy. This color scheme is very on trend right now. I'm sure you've seen it in home decor stores or other places. It's very, very trendy and cute. Here's one that I used that cute long arch rainbows, sending you a rainbow of happiness. Here's one I used kind of that negative space here. You make me happy. Here's one on this one. I actually was inspired with the colors from another home decor item that we have. And I loved that. I used this cute, I think it's supposed to be rain, but I used it kind of as a design in the background there. Super fun. And then this one, this one I used with the give it a whirl dies. So you can see it turns around. You make me happy. And then we have our rainbow cut from the dies. So, so cute. So fun. Like I said, this rainbow design is so on trend right now and it's so much fun. So if you love this stamp set and dies as much as we do, let us know. And if we need to send you a catalog, we'd love to do that. So you can get this product in January when it becomes available. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you next week for another Watch It Weekly Wednesday.